So this comment initially started go vegan and I responded, not everybody can do vegan, but if it works for you, that's great. And then his response is another excuse, plant-based cure. So this is typical, the gaslighting you get from uh, people that are on these plant-based diets and think that the entire world, the world's going to be saved by this diet um, and it's going to heal everyone. What is simply isn't true. You know, I've talked about this before. Melissa and I did this for seven years. We went the vegan vegetarian route and we had massive, massive leaky gut, right? SIBO, small intestinal bacterial overgrowth. And a huge part of our clients are recovering vegans. Typically vegans can do that diet for around seven, eight years and then they tank, they crash. This is very, very common. It's not talked about because this is part of the globalist agenda. If you don't believe me, look what the WEF is pushing, what is Klaus Schwab is pushing, what Bill Gates is pushing, what Bill Clinton is pushing. They're all pushing a vegan diet. So just take a minute and think about that. And secondly, our agriculture is tanking. We have enough topsoil to last maybe 30 years, 30 more crops, and there is no more fertilizer. Fertilizer is going through the roof. So we need herbivores, animals back on the land to regenerate the land. And when these herbivores are on the land and they're moved properly, they actually sequester more carbon than they put out. So we've been lied to in so many ways and we need to start to really start to be able to critically think and see what is going on. And we also do hair tissue mineral analysis. When we do HTMAs on long-term vegans, you can see the deficiencies that are in their hair samples. It is very, very common, okay? So there is so much more to this. And I want people to understand that, you know, if that is your diet and that's what you think, that's great. But don't shame and gaslight people and think that your diet is the only diet for everyone on this planet because it's very narrow-minded. You know, documentaries like Cowspiracy and Game Changers, right? These have programmed people heavily and these documentaries have no truth, no science to back this up. We can see this, okay, in our clients. We can see this every day with people that are having these issues and trying to change and make themselves healthy, but they don't need to be shamed for that. So no, if you're one of those lucky vegans that has done the diet for 20, 30 years and seriously is still healthy, that is amazing. That's awesome, but that's very, very rare, okay? And we need to understand this, that there is a diet for everyone, we're all unique, and we need to tap into that, listen to our bodies. I didn't listen to my body, that's why I went, kept going for so many years because I thought it was the best thing for me. I was programmed. Finally, I looked in the mirror one day, I had acne all over my face, I was 30 pounds overweight, my gut, I had so much dysfunction, my leaky gut was so bad. My gas was so bad. I was so sick. I finally woke up to what was going on. I changed my diet and I healed within a year. Okay. So just know that I'm sending you guys much love. Keep an open mind.